Hey guys, welcome to today's video, and in today's video we're going to be connecting this, which is the Texacom uh, OH-4W smoke and heat detector. So we're going to connect this to the alarm panel, and yeah. So yeah, we're going to connect this uh, smoke detector, this one, yeah, and uh, we're going to connect it to the alarm, so yeah, so what you want to do is go to your your keypad and just put in the engineer code I'll just blur this out and then it'll say you, you need to a user to log in and accept that this engineer is working on the system so you just put your code in and then it says do you want to enable engineer and then just click yes and then you have to put the engineer code in again and then it'll say do you want to go to a zone setup nope what we want to do is go into engineer utilities and click yes scroll down to do a bell test click yes and then basically click omit omit and just wait and then it'll say blah 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 when it comes up bell is disabled so now what you want to do is go outside and just double check that it is in engineer hold off yes the right light is flashing so that means it's in engineer hold off so now what we want to do is go to the panel take the fuse out the unit and then basically open the panel up and disconnect the battery right we're at the actual panel now here's the panel so what we want to do is uh, take the fuse out of that so let's just get some screwdrivers so what you want to do is see your fuse just want to pull that out move your screwdriver and then basically grab it and just pull it halfway out so if you can see the fuse look and then what you want to do is actually uh, take this uh, screw out of the panel and then basically do a mad dash so I'll just put you here while I do this come on there we go right basically undo it take this off don't forget your earth and just take the battery out that's it basically disconnect the battery like that so the panel's dead let's pop this down here right so here's the actual panel and then we need to locate the actual fire which is this I think floor PIR no it's not that one it will be I believe it's this one pretty sure it's this it's got to be so that's bedroom downstairs front door yeah it's got to be this one so yeah right there's your 12 volts right so what we're gonna do is use uh, green and yellow and red and black I'll just go double check that so it's green and yellow and then black and red basically snip that off snip this string off and then basically you want to strip this
what you want to do is connect your battery. The alarm won't go off because it doesn't boot on the battery. Connect your earth to your front panel and then basically slide this back in and hook it over the loop. That's it, that's in. Make sure it's stuck here. Put your top screw back in. You'll hear the tamper go click. There we go. The uh, zone six and plug it in. It's saying tamper on the actual keypad. So I'm just gonna go check the base. Right, let's see if it works now. Go get me vape. Yeah, it does work. <laughs> 